Greetings, people. It's Mr. Poo, the trigger, yet again on another episode of the Enlightenment series. If your answer is clear, wait for the Pesho. I wait if my answer is there. To the list, I shall walk. Now, you, your mama, I shall walk. I accept. I accept. You go prove, you go prove the Ashawo. Then your whole look up. The biggest Ashawo. Money love. I proko the biggest Ashawo. 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 You get money. You get money. Not be my money. You get waste. You get money. Not be my money. You get waste. You get money. You get one era. You get one era. Not be my money. You get waste. Ashawo. Ashawo. You waste. Bring yourself down. Go fuck your engineer. Now me they tell you now. Go call the name of the man when I fuck. You waste. You go fuck your own engineer. Your own engineer, you fuck him. That is that. Ashawo. You they call me Ashawo, and I hear but they call me Ashawo before. Yo, where did you be? Ashawo, Ashawo, Ashawo. Ashawo, your toto na what I they bring. See what she's saying. Ashawo. Ashawo. You they call me Ashawo for your live video. Now you be the Ashawo. You they call me Ashawo for your live video. Now you be the Ashawo. What does that? Do ten be. Ten video about me, I'm not gonna talk again. But what you go do you, eh? Facebook go shake. What you go do you? Facebook go shake. You when you go fuck your engineer. I shall walk, I shall walk, I shall walk. Talk about the thing, and I go post them. Should I shock you guys? I go post them. How can a prophet tell people? And you say they're talking, get their secrets, you go expose them. Yes, so. Anybody, even this happy, she get all her secrets. I not get happy, not do anything, no. I be not do anything when he get secrets. I be not do anything when he get secrets. Now you get secrets. Now you get secrets. You the fear of Pesho. The fear of Pesho is the beginning of prophetess grace. Idiot. I they say yes, yeah, so I they forward, I they forward them to you because now testimony. Train others. If I they verse, instead of me to go quarry, I will forward them to you. But I never know you are a betrayer. I never knew she can do it to me. You are a betrayer, big betrayer. You know and tomorrow you will hear from me. You go one shit for where you fed day. Yes. That kind of a thing. Yes, now so. Guilty Yes, so. Enough you wear, Joe. Enough you wait, oh. <laughs> Enough you wait, oh. Enough you wait. Enough you wait, oh. I get anything I go tell you today, eh? I get the proof. If you call me a shower, you go bring the proof out. You go bring the proof of my own shower out. Me, I go bring your own proof out. You insult my husband. Yes. It's a rumor, I mean. It's not rumor, no. It's not rumor. You do it. I hear it from your voice. You talk about it. You do it. It's not rumor. You do it. You do it. You don't have husband. Are you married? Are you married? They pay money for your head. 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 Eliver. You get. You get. Now let me go. I don't need to now. Who you give hundred euro? She not give me. She not give me hundred euro. She not give me hundred euro. She not give me hundred euro. God punish you. Who you give hundred euro? Who you give hundred euro? God punish you. I like the way prophetess they challenge this sleep. This one, I get what I go do you, em, eh? Mugu goat, what I go do you? As you plan me, I start plan you. Shabby, you draw me out. I say, you not draw me poo for your saga. You say, you not go sleep. You say, you not go green. You say, you not go green. You say, you not go green. Yes. 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 I snap and send for you, poster. Poster. 
Pastor! Monica, where go? Mommy, if you get my Toto poster, me say if I get your nakedness finished. Poster! So, apparently, there is fire on the mountain. There is too much confusion in the camp of the enemy. It seems the prophecy that Papa Jay gave on the 26th of March, it was actually meant to manifest at this very point in time. That prophecy is working in reverse. All the words of confusion that you prophesied towards the camp of baby testimony. It seems like now it's operating in reverse. His defense line, his front line of defense, his strong supporters and sons and daughters are now colliding. They are now exposing each other. And one thing I want to tell them is, they think this internal conflict or they think whatever that is happening is a coincidence. What I want to tell them that this ain't no coincidence. This is none other than baby testimony. <laughs> this is the spirit of baby testimony that is scattering the tables amongst them. And soon or later, they are going to expose each other. And soon or later, one amongst them is going to come out and tell us what they know about baby testimony. It's a process. And before they get to that point of them confessing and actually giving us what they know about baby testimony, they have to disgrace themselves first. But we warned them. We told them to stay very far much away from baby testimony's case. These women are the very same women who came together simply because they wanted to defend Jeremiah Omoto for fame. They became allies. Their relationship was built on disgracing Sister Ruth Matthew. These are the very same women who used to do many videos on a daily basis alleging that Ruth Matthew sold a child. Alleging that Ruth Matthew is lying. Embarrassing her, you know, calling her names. Saying all kinds of things concerning even her disability, her physical condition. But these are mothers who also have children. They never cared about baby testimony. They had formed this team together. These are people who used to stand together, fight together. And say all the horrible things you can think about. Again, in Sister Ruth Matthew and the baby testimony. But today, look at them. Look at what is happening amongst them. They are now exposing each other's Ashawo's business. They can never call each other Ashawo's if they do not know what they do behind the scenes. And for real, I have no doubt, they, it's, just, they, it's just a group of Ashawas. They are all Ashawas. And I once told you that anyone, any mother who comes to claim that Ruth Matthew is lying or who just does not have the heart to stand for a child that has been missing, is not a mother, but is an Ashawa. Now it is between themselves. The fight is between themselves. I've received multiple videos of them clashing and, you know, calling each other names, saying all sorts of things, exposing each other's businesses and everything that they built to fight against Sister Ruth Matthew. It looks like everything now is being broken down. The testimony spirit is scattering the table into pieces. It's dissolving the entire union that had brought them together because what had made them a, a strong team was the case of baby testimony not because they were advocating for baby testimony's justice but because they were advocating for jeremiah omoto's justice <laughs> these are people who actually believe that omoto had nothing to do with the with the abduction of baby testimony these are people who were actually saying that ruth Matthew is the one that sold baby testimony but look at god now look at what is happening amongst themselves it's only a matter of time. They are going to expose each other to the core. This case of baby testimony is no child's play. The spirit of baby testimony will avenge 
for every single evil thing that you have done on this case to obstruct his justice. For every ugly word that you have ever uttered against his mother. Maybe testimony can, can sense. I believe he can see everything that you people have been doing. And I know he's going to push all of you to the confession box. For now, you are you know, embarrassing each other. You are disgracing each other. It's okay. But I know a time is coming when you actually bring the topic of the conversation that you are not aware of. That is the one which has caused you to be having this kind of a conflict. You might think that you are just disagreeing on certain things or you're not getting along because of one or two rumors that circulated. But no. The issues that you think are the cause of the confusion in your camp, they are, they are petty issues. The main issue that is causing you people to be going, to be running helter skater like this, is the case of baby testimony. Because what brought all of you together was the case of baby testimony. What made you good friends was the case of baby testimony. And it is the very same case that is now causing you to expose each other. Both of you, if it is four of you, six of you, you are all ashamed to everything that women stand for. If you people could watch some of the video that these goons did against baby testimony, or again, a sister Ruth Matthew. You feel bad. You feel pity for all of them. I know you guys, you've been sending me multiple videos saying, look at this, look at this. I'm not going to post any of those, that nonsense. The rest of the nonsense that they're doing, I don't care about all that. The only thing I care about, the only time that I'll be excited in whatever that they're doing is when they start talking about baby testimony. I know for now, it's building up. They are getting to a point whereby they will start talking about what, co what made them stand against this baby testimony's case. And as for disgrace, she might have pretended. You know, the last video that she did when she was apologizing, she was saying, I will not respond to anyone. I'm going to, when I see bad comments, uh, with the case of baby testimony, you will wake up, mama. You wake up from this slumber. You will finish what you started. If you thought you remain silent forever or you will have an escape, a soft landing, or you walk away from this free of charge, you lied to yourself. All of you, you'll be brought to book and all of you will be held accountable for every piece of damage control that you did to obstruct baby testimony's justice. And someone sent me another short snippet of a message that was sent to Disgrace. Is it by one of her members that she was working with to obstruct baby testimony's justice? Now they are all turning against her. To talk, we are talking off. rubbish against okay. Roots. Okay. Roots is a shower. Roots is a shower. Roots is a shower. Can I see them? So you are the main a shower. Have you I know I made this video today. Turn around. Mm -hmm. Have you seen all the bini have given you saga? So you to talk there aside. Not all bini. Have you seen how mommy, mommy, mommy love and Kate are giving you wood to wood to? Okay now. Nah. Have you seen? Mm -hmm. Where is Anita? Anita Chamber. Okay. Disgrace. Mm -hmm. Have you seen? So you are the main scammers. Mm -hmm. Black men are blacking mm -hmm. people around you in your church. Mm -hmm. Fake. Mm -hmm. So you used to go to Babalawa. Oh. God with this grace. Thank you, God. We are no more fighting for 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 Omoto again. Yeah. Omoto that is sleeping with you every day. Mm. So you Toto they are fine. They sleep with me every Don't day. Don't worry. Mm. Don't worry, mommy. Love will share that you Toto. Okay. Uh, that all the chains she have. Don't worry. Mm. We will make her to saga you. Okay. We will hear everything around you. Oh, now that's the meaning of you, the saga now. Be... So a a girl that careful. Mm. You are fighting. Fight, fighting roots, mm -hmm. fighting roots, baby. Mm -hmm. This one have hurting you, Wutu Wutu. Mm -hmm. Hey, I know, mommy. You are ready to sell, sell. Mm, 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 okay. All of them are turning against disgrace, and this is what I want to tell disgrace. If you are wiser, 
Do the right thing now. Tell the world what you know. You tempered with the wrong case, you people. Before you all... <laughs> This thing is gonna be it's gonna be bloody. That's what they do not know. It's gonna get messy. And it's all gonna go, it's it's all gonna go down in their circles, not anywhere far. And none of them is immune to pay for the damages that they caused to baby testimonies case. None of them is, Im is immune to face the consequences of their actions. So if you're out there, you're planning or you're thinking of doing a video to say, no, Jeremiah Omoto is right, or even all these followers in the comments that have been talking nonsense, the spirit of baby testimony is getting to you. <laughs> I tell you and I promise you. Papa J right now is going through the worst. He's going through the most. If you can see an entire Papa J going through the most, what more of this uh, baby charlatan? If you do an audit of all the people that have ever spoke against baby testimony, watch them. Look at them now. They are proof and they are evidence of baby testimony's wrath. Because the baby testimony will come and you will avenge for all the mess that these people have been causing. So be awoke, my people. The boy needs justice. And the boy is restless. He will never settle down. He will never rest until he's reunited with the mother. That's the fight. That's what causes all of us to be talking like this, to be coming up daily like this, advocating for his justice and his peace. The day he gets reunited with the mother, all this will go away. But still people have to pay for the damages that they have caused. And they will all, they shall all pay. Until they come out, they confess, they apologize direct to Sister Ruth Matthew. If they don't pay the price, their children will pay the price. That's just what it is. Karma knows everyone's address, my people. Karma knows where you stay. It's only a matter of time when he decides to visit you. And when he does, if he does not get you, you will get the ones that you love. Because if you can't show remorse, if you can't show an ounce of care or concern to a disabled mother who lost a child, then what makes you human? If you can't care for the mother, okay, I understand. But if you can't care for the child, what does the child know? It's just an innocent fella who's probably, was probably supposed to be the president or who's probably supposed to be the president of Nigeria in the future. If you can't care for a child, then what form of a human being are you? So you don't deserve any mercy. It's very sad. And it's also good. The reason why I bring stuff like this is so that I can also alert other people out there that are tempted to interfere in this case, to do damage control for Omoto for fame. To just tell them that this is not a case that you want to play with. This is a very serious case. It's not child's play. You can do damage control on scandal cases, scandalous cases of pastors sleeping with women. It's okay. You can get away with those. But on this one, children are innocent. They are very innocent and they are very pure. And it is their purity and holiness that will scatter the tables of the enemy. Never touch innocent children. Never ever in your entire lives. The consequences will be unbearable. If it does not affect you, it will affect your children, your own children, or your own loved ones. I did not even want to bring this thing, but I just had to bring it so that you people know what's going on. We have other important issues to be addressing. But these kind of calamities, these kind of confrontations, when they start exposing each other, it's good piece of evidence to show that we are going somewhere, we are headed somewhere. 
and the enemies are yet to be defeated. So till I meet you again on the next episode of the Latterman series, it's Mr. Paul the Trigger. I'm out. <laughs>